All right, hey everyone, room 16. Um, I'm here at school. It is Monday the 21st. Just getting ready for you guys to come back to school tomorrow and um, finally getting in here, taking care of some little critters in our classroom. Um, of course, from our vote the other day, you guys remember that we were going to feed our earth, or not earthworms, I'm sorry, our red wiggler worms, the noodles, different types of food. Um, as you can see, they made short work out of everything left in there. There is nothing here except for newspaper, maybe the odd little piece of peel that's left over. But more or less, they've taken care of everything. So they are hungry and ready to go. Perfect for our um, little experiment to test what type of food they, they like. Now, on our poll on our blog this week, we voted between mango. We voted for mango and sugar-covered tea bags. So I have some tea bags here with some sh um, little pieces of sugar on it. So I'm going to go ahead and put those in. I might just break them up just a little bit, just have a little more easier time getting in there. Sorry, guys. So there's tea bag number one, tea bag number two. Again, these are a little sweetened with some sugar. Uh, so maybe I don't know if they're going towards it right now or not. They might be just trying to avoid me. Of course, they don't really know if I'm a predator or not. Oh, we have one little guy who's trying to escape here. Come on, pal. Let's try to help you find your way back in. Okay, now it's time to put the mango and the mango juice over on this side. So we have different foods on different ends. Lots of bird or uh, worm poop in here. Powerful poops. Nutrient poops, as we've been calling them in class. So there's our mango. We have our mango our tea bags. We're going to go ahead and cover them up. And right now my observation says that there's lots of little babies. Let's see if maybe I can find some little tiny ones before I go. I found some earlier. Um, they are being pretty shy. Some little ones around here somewhere. Um... The smell of the box is earthy. It doesn't smell like rotted food, which is a good thing. Because that's, remember, what uh, we're supposed to see. We shouldn't have any smell. That's why this is a good thing to have inside your house, under your sink. Okay. So, um, we're going to just come back and check on these tomorrow before we do our computer class. And we'll see how everything's going on there. All right. Hope you guys have a great rest of your weekend. And see you soon. Bye.